Meghan and Harry paid $120,000 for Gior Craig as advisor to silence opposing voices. They bought censorship. A source on X yesterday revealed that Meghan and Harry continue to align themselves with the censorship industrial complex and their involvement with Gior Craig, who Archwell paid $120,000 to advise them on what exactly. She works for democratic politicians advising on how to manipulate social media to silence opposing voices. Harry and Meghan are the two biggest spreaders of disinformation and misinformation and are desperately trying to find some way to overcome the US First Amendment rights so they can overtly censor social media. Dior Craig is mentioned in the landmark court case Missouri v Biden. You know where the government's being sued for violating the First Amendment rights of Americans on social media. Meghan and Harry are the last people anyone needs telling people what is and isn't misinformation. They already fully participated in the internet safety legislation in Australia. If this kind of censorship legislation passes here, under the guise of fighting mis- and disinformation, Harry and Meghan will be directly involved. And that's not the only way they want to manipulate people. Part of this safety is programming young people to think correctly. Why do you think they want access to young people? Watch TRG on this. It's important to understand exactly what they're into and how deep. I've watched most, if not all, of TRG's videos since she started investigating this, and I have to say they're alarming. The fact that British royal family members are in any way involved in any of the things they are, trying to shut down free speech is staggering at best. Anyway, without the titles, nobody would have anything to do with them. Within the next year, nobody will want to be associated with them anyway. They'll both be that couple who threw away the biggest opportunity they'd ever get to make a difference. So many people, including royal experts and members of parliament, are urging King Charles to strip Meghan and Harry's titles. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry could face financial problems if the UK strips away their royal titles. And a new report quotes a Hollywood expert as to exactly how much money Meghan and the Duke of Sussex could lose without their beloved royal names. One word, millions. A new report via the New York Post reveals that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle face the risk of losing millions of dollars if the royal titles become removed. And a Hollywood expert, Mark Boardman, explained the link between royal titles and Meghan and the Duke of Sussex's income. The potential for Meghan and Harry to get stripped of the royal titles first rose when Meghan and the Duke of Sussex quit their duties as senior working royals in 2020. Though the couple moved from the United Kingdom to California, they still held on to their Duchess and Duke titles. However, increasingly, both the UK public and some politicians have called for King Charles to strip away Meghan's and Harry's royal titles. But entertainment expert Mark Boardman believes that Meghan and the Duke of Sussex could face a financial crisis without their titles. And Boardman warned that he sees both long-term and short-term damage for Meghan and Harry if they lose their titles. The potential costs of losing royal titles could be substantial, not only for the immediate financial impact, but also the long-term effects on their earning potential, revealed the Hollywood expert.